Hey, welcome back to another episode of Unboxing Reviews and More. I'm Ruth Ann. Larry's my videographer. Hi, Larry. Hey. <laughs> he is excellent at it, and I appreciate him so much. So, just needed to give that little shout out. Let's see what we have today. I think I have two items in here. One of them is not important. It's just little carbon filters for my cat litter box, and we don't need to review that. But the other... Unless they want to. If you want to, just tell them they work good. Yes, it really, they really do or help. They have a litter move. Yes, they really do help cut down on, uh, on the odor. So, this is one that we will, here's the unboxing for, and we will have to do the update tomorrow because this is a, I don't know what I did with my phone. This is a, um, so these are solar Christmas lights. You heard me, solar Christmas lights. Okay, this was a, I believe it was a hundred yards. And okay, a hundred feet. I said yards because I was thinking it was a third of a football field. <laughs> so that's where yards came from. <laughs> oh, it comes with a remote control comes with the LED lights, I believe. Oh, that's what it is. There's 300 of uh, the lights. So there's uh, three per feet. That's what it was. The solar charger. Power button on the back. Ah, uh, darn it. Well, you get a little bit of a flash there. Yeah. It was, yeah. And then different modes oh, oh there you go. yeah you've got a quick twinkle a slower twinkle a fade there you go those are pretty cool so it There's... just charges up every day out in the sun yes and it looks like i it looks like you have to figure out how to use it because I don't see any instructions. This is obviously so that you can mount this if you want. Mount the uh, solar charger. I think that you have your remote. Is to, the stick what? It was to mount it. Oh, yes. That's, uh, sorry, that was what I meant. You're correct. I, I don't say my entire thoughts because everybody's supposed to read my mind. Okay, you can mount this on something. Um, I'm thinking, honestly, about probably just mounting it to a tree, in which case I will definitely need bigger um, screws than this. And I'm doing that because that's where this is. these are going to be. I'm going to wrap my tree in my front yard. I wanted the solar so that I didn't have to have uh, extension cords dragged across my yard. Even though I've never had problems, I don't like the idea of extension cords and things plugged in out in the weather and the snow and the rain. Electricity and wet are just not really a good combination. Also, tripping over cords, it can be a hazard. And, um, in my opinion, and some people are really, really good at hiding them or going along the side of a driveway or something. Really not an option at my house. And I just think it looks tacky. So I opted for this and I also don't have to pay for it because I'm not running electricity. It's going to be free from the sun. So I'm pretty happy about that. Um, remote control. Remove battery separator before use, which is good. Most of the time, uh, these things have battery separators, but every now and then you get them and, and they don't. And sometimes they've been mashed on something uh, during transit. 
So, he, can you see this? This is what your remote looks like. Mm -hmm. And I really wish I could actually plug timer it, too. plug it you in. A timer, a dimmer, and a mode. That's cool. Yes. Make sure you zero in on my torn up hands. I was installing some some lights today in my house. So we're not doing a review on those right now. Okay, it says charging, and it also says out, and it says on. So here's what the back of it looks like, and I don't know exactly what all of that means. Mm, don't know. And I'm going to have to figure it out because, like I said, I don't think that there is an instruction manual. That's okay. Um, I am trying to figure uh, this out. While you have a charger for a solar thing? <laughs> I mean, maybe it just charges, a, a, you know, maybe it's maybe solar or... Maybe you can charge or... your phone while you're charging your Christmas lights. No, because <laughs> it goes in with a uh, doohickey. Uh, I don't know. That. A doohickey. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all know what a doohickey is, don't you? <laughs> All right. Uh, hey, that's real secure. And it has a rubber gasket there to help keep the weather out. See the rubber gasket there? Yep. So that's good. Um, I really don't know. These also, it said that they were fairy lights. They're a little bit bigger than fairy lights, in my opinion. But these look like the pretty good kind that you can almost step on and try to smash with your heel and won't. Not that I plan on it. Plus, it'll be in my wrapped around my tree out front. So I don't think that we're, we're really going to have too many smashing issues. Unless your karate kick in it. Hey, Cobra Kai could, could come. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> strike hard, strike fast, no mercy. Um, I don't know. I don't know what else to say. I'm just so excited about this. Do you have, do you have any thoughts? Nope. Well, yep. Well, I don't know. I'm interested also to see if we have multicolor on this. I can't remember and I don't see. Don't think so. <laughs> How was that for timing? Yeah, I don't see anything about it, but that's okay because I don't want multicolor. I really want, you know what? It's a, it was a solid. Multicolor was a choice. Again, the link will be in the description. So some of the stuff that I'm that I'm a little vague on, I can't look it up because I think I left my phone in the other room charging. I think that I intentionally bought it like this just because I like the uh, cool white or blue color. Um, so yeah, I don't know. I think that's it. All right. Well. Not much else to say. We'll give you an update. Be sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Hi, welcome back to another update. This is our solar Christmas lights. How awesome is that? No cords, no nothing. We have them strung along the tree here. And I could not figure out the remote no matter. I pulled the, uh, the uh, battery protector separator thing to so that if the buttons got pressed it didn't use up the battery before the product was was uh, bought so i pulled that out can't get the the remote to do anything so i don't it also didn't come with the instructions so i can't figure it out the way it twinkles and then stays on and it's fine with me <laughs> it's a start maybe by by christmas i'll have it figured out until then though the uh, if you can zoom in down here, I just have the little solar panel, the little solar panel plugged in, the lights twisted around the tree, and I mean you can see this is a pretty decent sized tree here, <laughs> and it's wrapped around all the way from down here 
to up here and uh, it just charges through the uh, through the sun and no cord and slightly cords that can trip somebody and pretty happy so there you have it be sure to like subscribe hit the notification button and god bless